Hello, welcome to this video where we're going to take a look at how combining Equatio and Google Forms can create an opportunity for students to engage in a deeper learning experience. My name is SJ and this video is part of the Equatio in the Classroom series. As a teacher, we've created a Google Form using a short answer text response. In our responses, we have one response, but the answer is incorrect. How as a teacher can we identify where this misconception arose? Let's hop into the student view and see how Equatio can help. As a student, because I have the Equatio Chrome extension turned on, I have this blue icon here. When I select it, the familiar Equatio toolbar opens up. I'm going to select Insert Math Space. Math space is our whiteboarding space for expressing all our ideas with maths and this blue icon means we can insert it back into the Google form. I can now submit this to my teacher. Back in the teacher view, I can now identify that the student has misread the question. They've drawn a rectangle instead of a square so I can offer appropriate feedback for my students. We have looked at how by combining Equatio and Google Forms, we can create stronger connections between student and teacher in the learning of maths. This video is part of the Equatio in the Classroom series, full of hints and tips to help you get started with Equatio in your classroom.